The Nigeria police force has had its fair share of allegations of victimization, non-inclusion and discrimination against women, but now says it has turned the bend. At this conference for female police officers in Abuja, the police hierarchy says it has now incorporated some of the higher standards in its training to promote inclusivity and discourage abuse of female members of the force. It is also aimed at helping in reducing the gender gap in the force to ensure equal opportunity, institutionalizing gender responsive budgeting, as well as incorporation of principles of CED, AW, and other global and regional national framework, among others. This is in tandem with United Nations UN SCR 1325 on security sexual reform. I have no doubt that with this reform, police women and men will have equal access to roles, opportunities, and rewards as long as they merit it. The Minister of State for Police says every woman police will be given the needed resources to strive in whatever role she is given in the Nigeria Police Force. As women police officers, we must emerge, we must rise above average. We must crave out our space in a domain that has historically undermined our abilities and potential contribution. The journey to fully unlock our potentials requires determination, resilience, and a commitment to continuous self-improvement. Assistant Inspector General of Police, Aisha Tabubaka, is the most senior female officer of the Nigeria Police Force. She is head of the Nigeria Police Gender Unit and encourages girls to join the profession so as to help build their community. Well, what will bring, recently, as I said in my uh, speech, we are in the process of reviewing the Nigerian police gender policy, which we had since 2010, and that one is supposed to address issues of gender mainstreaming across board, where we have the Nigerian police is position itself to be gender more gender responsive in its approach both externally in its interaction with the society with the community and also within the police force so we are going to see a lot of transformation we are getting to see women at uh, decision making position that's what we are aiming for the nigeria police began recruiting female officers in 1955 and women now consist 9% of its population this is a far cry for a country with a larger female population the Conference for Female Police Officers is part of efforts to boost the capacity of women in the force and create a convenient atmosphere to attract young girls and women. Ferdinand Duroha, Arise News.